We're getting old. I'm doing old people things. Things like cycling everywhere and not getting fingered. <laughs> boring. <laughs> it's boring. You twenties. Wait till you get to your thirties. No one wants to finger you. Um, um, my womb, right, my womb has become some sort of hormonally powered onboard sat-nav, which I did not install, okay? Sort of just fucking directing me towards men, you know? <laughs> just like, ooh. <laughs> Proceed to the sperm. <laughs> I was like, stop it, he's in a situation ship. <laughs> Proceed to the sperm. Stop it! He's an alcoholic. What's <laughs> <sighs> up? <laughs> Minimal childhood trauma. You have arrived! Stop it. My body's changing, body's changed, it's okay, right? My ass, right? My ass is slowly melting down the back of my leg, okay? Every time I look in the mirror, side on, it gets a little bit fucking lower, okay? I'm gonna get a Sharpie and start marking it like you do on a kid's birthday. <laughs> I'm okay with it, I'm okay, I'm, I'm proud to be a woman, you know, I'm, I embrace my body, yes, thank you. Um, the only issue I have with it is in certain pairs of jeans, tight, tight jeans, such as a skinny, you know, tend to cut in into the back of the leg, creating a string around ham type effect, okay? Creating a second ass <laughs> underneath the ass, I already have, okay? So if you do the maths, that's four cheeks. Yeah. Four cheeks, two asses, two asses. I asked my boyfriend if it bothered him, he said no. I enjoy group sex. Hey. <laughs> 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 I wish that was a lie. Um, I was alone during the pandemic. I know, squish, squish, oh, squish, squish. Um, I, went, I went to some pretty dark places, okay? I got bored of my vibrator, you know? <laughs> happens, happens. Um, so what I thought I'd do is like, just, you know, for a laugh, experiment with other household objects, you know? Because I, I think it's important to rotate <laughs> in every sense of the word. She'll thank me. <laughs> um, so, so after a fairly close call with a battery-operated milk foamer, I um, <laughs> I wish that was a lie. <laughs> I um, I landed on a remote control. What I found, not landed. That wasn't my method of testing. <laughs> my, <laughs> my method of testing was perfectly normal, aside from the fact that I was using an old television remote. Um, I've spent a lot of time in America. That's not a, a brag. Oh. Yeah. Fuck. <laughs> I forgot we can travel again. America, uh, nothing wrong with it, except the tipping. The tipping drives me mad, it confuses me, okay? Because you don't just tip the waiters and the cabbies, you tip the beauticians. What the, f how, what is the appropriate amount to tip a woman responsible for lasering the hair off of my asshole? <laughs> is, it, is it still 10%? Well, you say that, mate, but I had to hold my own cheeks open. <laughs> Do I get some money for that? In fact, <laughs> in fact, <laughs> this is no word of a lie, right? I nearly asked for a refund. Here I am, ready, on my belly. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> on my belly, wait, ready and 
waiting, you know, she's there about to, holding the laser, ready to go. I'm thinking, fuck, just let this be over. She makes a noise of concern. <laughs> she goes, oh, <laughs> what, what, what? She said, oh, it's just your asshole. What do you mean, what? She said, it's, it's, uh, it's very dark. <laughs> Would you like me to bleach your arsehole for you? I thought, that's not fair. Here I am in arguably the most vulnerable position a human being can put themselves in, and she is link-selling me her services. <laughs> in the end, I think I over-tipped. I tipped 20, the service only cost 10. Why? I felt like I had to pay for her silence. <laughs>